Hello, this is Erin from Morehouse Farm with today's knitting tip, which is how to join yarn without a knot, without weaving in ends. This is a fantastic method that'll work with any really lightly spun yarn, much like our three strand, and we can take advantage of wool's felting properties to help us join the yarn. So what you're gonna need to do is find the two ends of the yarn that you wish to join, and you're gonna rough them up a bit for about a half inch to an inch. Our three strand, you can see, pulls apart in about three different pieces and you need to do that to both ends of the yarn. So once that's done, you need to add a little bit of moisture, just a little bit, not a lot. And you can do that however you wanna get moisture onto the yarn. I've got a little bowl of yarn here, and all I'm gonna do is dampen it. I do not want it to be wet. And that's probably why this technique has the nickname the spit splice, because grandma didn't have water traveling with her or at her side all the time in order to be able to moisten the yarn. So she just wet her fingers and went to town. So once we've got our ends roughed up and moistened, what we're gonna do is put them together, just overlap them, and then we're gonna twist. I like to start by rolling them back and forth together in my fingers like this. And you can see they've started to join because those natural fiber properties of wool allow them to grab onto each other. Now to cement this, if you wanna make sure that it's really nice and tight, I found that putting it in my palm and then rolling my other hand back and forth along the top really gives some good friction. I can feel the heat being created and that makes the yarns really felt together. As you can see here, I've been joining along the way, yellow to blue and then blue back to yellow. And the beautiful part of that is there's nothing that needs to be woven in here. So you can do this with any type of really lightly spun yarn and it's a fantastic way to make sure that there's nothing that you need to then weave in at the end. And I would say it's pretty hard to find. These are easy to locate because I've changed color, but can you find where I spit spliced the yellow yarn? Me either. And that's what makes it such a fantastic join. Happy knitting from Morehouse Farm.